Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am coming at you with the long awaited hair routine video with relaxed hair. Today I am doing a um, straight hair routine and then I think I'm gonna what, I'm gonna do like two separate videos. This this will be my straight hair routine with relaxed hair, and then I'll do like more of a natural look um, in another video because I did get to keep uh, or I did get to keep I did keep a lot of my natural curls. They're just looser now, um, and I'm still kind of like trying to tweak my natural hair natural hair curl pattern, um, like my more like curly curl pattern. I just haven't like ever like had to basically keep up with like a curly pattern because I always straightened it because I didn't really want to deal with my curly hair um but yeah so this is my hair straight um this is let's see I first relaxed my hair after eight years um in July of this year no June no July of this year so it's been about three months July August September yeah about three months and I relaxed my hair um last week and then I left it alone. I didn't flat iron it or anything. Um, and then I waited a week just to manipulate it and bother it. I didn't want to do that um, right after I um, flat ironed or right after I relaxed it. So I waited a week. It's actually a little bit over a week um, that I'd actually done anything with it, washed it or anything. And I want to show you guys my routine. So let's get into the video. Okay, so before I get into the video, I want to show you all the products that I use in the shower before I head in the shower. Um, so the day before I, um, I like to do this kind of once a week anyway, but especially the day before I wash my hair, I'll use like a nice hair oil treatment. Um, I've been using the Canvas hair blossom serum for a while. I just, I just haven't had to like use it up. I don't, I haven't noticed anything crazy with it, but it's nice to have something on my scalp just to, I guess, nourish it right before I wash it. Um, and then recently I just picked up this African Pride Moisture Miracle. Um, it has grapeseed oil or it has castor oil, grapeseed oil, argan, coconut, and olive oil in it. And I just, all I do is, sorry, this, the camera's not as high up as I like. Um, I just squeeze it all into my scalp like this. Um, the Canva one I got off the website and then this other, this one I got, um, where did I get this from the store like the hair store um and then for shampoo and conditioner um I use the olive oil moisture restore creamy aloe shampoo um along with the conditioner that goes with it as well so um this one has is a sweet orange scent the shampoo smells so good oh my god um and then I just recently used the olive oil in the perm box um, it comes with this and I really liked the smell of, I think I've always used this one as a shampoo. I just never paired it with a conditioner before. Um, and then I just recently used the conditioner when it, when I perned my hair, the one that came into the, in the box with the relaxer. So I just thought my, I might as well just use that. So I'm going to go wash my hair and I'll be right back. So hair is washed and I also wanted to show you all, I use this scalp massager to, um, what do I do that to? You know shampoo my hair and I'll just do that um, instead of using my my nails um, I'll go on with my nails a little bit afterward just to make sure that I got everything um, but I do that and then with conditioner in it I'll use this brush um, these brushes have been pretty popular I actually really like it I don't think it's a gimmick <laughs> like just I think it's just the way that it just you know does that like it spreads I get a lot less um, hair shedding with this so it's really nice because after I got did a relaxer the first time my hair just shed like crazy and I would use wide tooth combs but I feel like this works a lot better um and when I was very skeptical about it for, at first I don't know what it is maybe my hair is just getting stronger or it's something about this that works really well so I don't typically brush my hair with anything except a bristle brush if I'm slicking my hair back or if I'm in the shower and I use this so anywho so the next thing there's um there's no product in my hair this is just how it is uh after i get out the shower um and then i'll have to section it off in like two and then i'll work on one side and i'll split it again um and i'll put in my heat protectant it's like the first thing i do and then honestly that doesn't really go in any order but i like to do this first and this has my Garnier 
um, heat protectant and this Cantu Thermal Shield heat protectant all in one. I just like poured them all in the same bottle so I didn't have so much in there. Um, and then I will go in with um, my, an oil. This is the Moroccan Argan Oil Silky Serum. I don't know, just like a random oil that I got. And I'll put like that much in, not too much. And I'll mostly focus this on my ends. Let me split this again. I'll put that on the end. Boom. And then whatever I have left over, I'll just put it on my scalp and then run it through. Um, sometimes I'll go in with this um, Lather's Curls Moisturizer. Lately, I've just been using it if I just want to like, leave my hair like this. Um, but today, we're straightening hair. I'm straightening my hair, so I'm not going to do that. Um, and then I'll go on with the Motions Versatile Foam Styling Lotion love this stuff i swear by it and i'll just put like a few pumps in each section and i also use this if i don't straighten it as well but i'll do a whole separate video on like when i leave my hair curly like wavy you know like this um but today i'm just gonna straighten it um one thing that i like to do is um i'm almost out of this i already have I already have one on backup. Um, one thing that I like to do is every two weeks um, when I wash my hair, I'll try to wash, actually I'll try to wash my hair every week at least once because I've noticed like it's healthy. Like I think for as black women, we, we tend not to like wash our hair, which I know, I feel like I've kind of come to figure out my hair and it needs to be washed and I can tell like when it's like, super oily and it's just my hair's like wash me please. But anyways, as black women, we just don't wash our hair as much because we've been conditioned to do that. And everyone's different. Um, don't get me wrong, everybody's completely different. Wash your hair how you feel you, you need to wash it. But once a week, I'll wash it. And then like between those weeks, like one week, I'll straighten it. And then next week, I'll just leave it um, curly or whatever, you know? So I, I only try to put heat on my hair um, twice a month. Um, so yeah, anyway, so I'll do that and then just brush through it gently um, and then all the products that I mentioned I will link down below in my Amazon Amazon storefront so be sure to check it out if you guys want to um, I will go in with uh, I'll put this hair wrap on I got this from Walmart a long time ago I'll link I'll link uh, one similar in my Amazon storefront, but I'll wrap my hair up in this if my hair's like crazy wet for whatever reason. Today, I feel like it's pretty okay, but I'll wait till my hair is about 90% dry before I go in with a um, blow dryer to blow it out. So yeah, so I will be back once my hair is mostly dry. So I ended up putting my hair up in this t-shirt because it just was wet and the, air, the um, AC is on, so I wanted to get it off my shoulders because it was getting like this wet. Um, but I'm gonna go in and blow dry real quick. This is my handy dandy blow dryer. Um, and I don't really have a method to my madness. I just split my hair in two. I used to go through and like do it in sections, but it's so much easier to blow dry my hair now that I don't have to do that. So I just kind of split it in two and I'll blow dry it. So let's get started. Cheese flat iron. I have no idea like what 
like version this says i've had this since college as well um i'm sure a lot of my old followers know I, this is my tried and true as well and i have no idea um like what year it is or anything it's just my it's my flat iron it just has one setting on and off so i don't even know how hot it gets um i'll use a comb or a bristle brush i don't have my bristle brush in here with me i need to buy a new one actually so i'll just use this comb here and i can take pretty big sections now since i permed it um i definitely need a trim as well because my ends look horrible but i didn't get a chance to get it i did trim it a little bit myself um but i need like a thorough a thorough um trim so trims are definitely important and then keeping your ends hydrated is very important for my relaxed girl straightening it and this is pretty much what it looks like um like i said i definitely need a trim um but i will say since the first time i did flat iron it um let me put my glasses on it has felt significantly better and i've gotten a lot less shedding uh still a pretty good amount but it's about the same as what it was before i just don't flat iron my hair very often um so that may be a key as well yeah so this is it i will literally not flat iron it again for another couple weeks if that um yeah that's my hair routine my straight hair routine with um relaxed hair thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video